Rated everyone 10 and up. Need for Speed Most Wanted lets you race, chase and explore like never before. And there's even more freedom on Xbox 360 thanks to Kinect. Home the privilege to get an exclusive demo with producer Chris Roberts. Chris, Need for Speed Most Wanted is finished at last. Yep. How long has it been um, in development for? Well, we started work on it pretty much as soon as we'd finished Hop Suit, so I'd say around two years. A unique thing with this, it doesn't have menus as such. It's got a thing called Easy Drive, uh, where you can select uh, mods, cars, chassis, rollouts when you're in the game. What was the decision to do that? We didn't want to bring you to a, a garage screen or a pause screen or overuse the map screen. So the player can bring this Easy Drive system up at any time and the game is still running. So when they get skilled at it, they can do it whilst they're driving as well. When was that decision made to put Connect into the game? So um, we obviously play a lot of games. So um, I'm a massive uh, Mass Effect fan. So I played Mass Effect through with Connect and I just loved the way they handled the voice in that game. I thought it was really cool. And then also we're geeks working games. So uh, you know, I'm a big Iron Man fan as well. And I just thought it would be kind of cool to control a lot of the aspects of the car with your voice and Connect just seemed to be a really nice way to do that. Do you want to just talk us through how this works? Sure. Um, when we were picking stuff to do, some of them we picked just because it would be cool. Yeah. Um, so say for instance, when you start the game, the engine's off on the car. So saying engine start on the car and having the engine start uh, <laughs> it, it is, is kind of cool. We like it, especially when you're driving at night and stuff, you go engine start and the headlights come on. It's, <laughs> kind of a little bit of a geeky thing. Going off. If the player is being chased by the police and they've parked up, then they can say, look around, um, and the camera will spin around the car. And the speed that camera spins around is tuned to how fast you're driving. So it's really cool. So if you're, if you're hiding, you want to look where the cameras are. So because some people may forget that the right stick is, is how, you, how you move the camera around yeah. in, in the heat at the moment, but they may remember, I need to look around, and then they look around. And there you go That's again. <laughs> uh, and then, we do stuff like if I drive up to a car down this alleyway, is a rather smart Audi R8, and um, I can just say drive car, uh, and it will it will go into the car. And you jump straight in. So talk us through the easy drive menu. Uh, you can do your mods, you can change car. Yep. How would that work with Connect? So I can say um, easy drive, and it will bring up easy drive, um, and then I can say what I see on this top menu. So if, say for instance, I could go to change car. Uh, and then I can see all the cars that I've got and I go, um, so I go next, yes, yes. And you're in, and if you're driving and if you're in the heat of battle with the police, you don't have to again do that uh, crazy thing you do with your thumbs that you do very well. Yeah, exactly, well, you, can do, you can do so, and we also have shortcuts. So I could say, for instance, go straight, if I'm being chased by the, the, the cops, I could go chassis, and it will bring up the chassis menu and I could change uh, if I'd unlocked it for my car to reinforce chassis, which makes me tougher against the cops when they're chasing me. So in a way, you can actually eliminate sub-menus as well. So you don't have to go yeah. easy drive and then tyres. No, exactly. You could, you, could, you could say, if you just say tyres. Tyres. And up it comes. That's yeah. cool. So then you can pick your different tyre and then you can say drive and that will get rid of easy drive. So when you're planning keywords for Connect, yep. you have to be careful about which word you choose. And did that affect the easy drive menu? In it did, and, and you know we looked um, very closely at what, at what Microsoft do themselves um, for the general um, Xbox dashboard. So they have a little glossary of terms that appear. So when we bring up Easy Drive, um, we have a li our little glossary of terms, which is in s similar in style to how people are, are used to controlling what everybody has when they have Connect. So Chris, do you think using Connect is going to help my gameplay? Yeah, I think I think you'll get more use of using Easy Drive, and then that will help you go faster, jump further, win more races, set faster times. So yeah, I think generally it is you know better with Connect. Better with Connect for Xbox 360.